today we are going to see how the data transfer is done in the transmission control protocol in the transmission control protocol there are mainly three phases there is a connection establishment data transfer and termination so if any device is using the tcp protocol it has to follow these three phases which are the connection established data transfer and connection termination now let's see how this three phases works let's see the first one that is the connection establishment you can see that on this figure there is a one client and there is a one server now right now the client wants to make connection with the server if client wants to make any connection to the server it will create one packet you can see that in this packet there are several fields there is a sequence number there is a acknowledgement flag there is a scene flag apart from that there are other informations too such as the receiver window size right now you can see that in this figure there are three fields 8000 which is the sequence number acknowledgement flag and scene flag the packet is created by the client and it is sent to the server now right now the value of the acknowledgement flag is 0 and the value of the scene flag is 1 that is why this packet is known as scene packet scene means synchronization now when server receives the scene packet which is sent by the client server can easily understand that that client wants to create connection with itself so when server receives that packet it will reply with scene plus ack and you can see that in that scene plus ack packet there are several fields too there is a sequence number which is 15000 there is a acknowledgement which is 8001 and the acknowledgement is always plus 1 from what the server has received so you can see that the client has sent the sequence number 8000 packet and the server has replied with 8001 ack 8001 but at the same time server has sent the sequence number 15000 why because server is now sending its own packet with its own sequence so server will follow its own sequence and client will also follow its own sequence and always remember the tcp connection establishment it is the three way connection three way connection it means not only client is creating the connection with the server but server is also trying to connect with the client so right now when the server is sending scene plus egg flag from the acknowledgement the client will understand that the server has received the packet that is just sent by the client but from the scene flag the client will understand that okay now the server is also trying to make connection with me so when the client receives scene plus egg it will understand that server is also trying to create the connection and it will reply with the acknowledgement you can see that the sequence number it is 8000 it can be 8001 but right now we don't want to waste any sequence so that is repeated and the acknowledgement is 15001 and the value of the acknowledgement flag is 1 so this is how the tcp connection is established the first flag is the scene flag reply is scene plus acknowledgement ack and the last one is acknowledgement after the connection is established the next phase is data transfer after the data transfer is done the last phase is connection terminated right now you can see that in this figure in the first part the connection is established by the client and in the second part the connection is established by the server now let's see how the connection is terminated again there are two devices there is a client and server and all the communication all the data transfer is completed so now the client is no longer interested to receive any packets so in that case the client has to close the connection which is created by itself so to close the connection the client will generate a packet that is pin in this packet there is a sequence number there will be acknowledgement number and the value of the fin flag and right now the value of the fin flag is 1 so when server receives that packet from the fin flag server will understand that the client is no longer interested and now it wants to close the connection so when server receives that packet it will reply with fin plus egg 
from the acknowledgement when client receive that packet which is sent by the server from the acknowledgement the client will understand that the request of the connection termination is received by the server and from the fin the client will understand that okay the server is also interested to close the connection that is why the fin flag is one so the request which is sent by the client it is fin the reply which is given by the server it is fin plus ack from that fin plus ack the client will reply acknowledgement and the value of the ack flag will be one so this is how the connection is terminated and the tcp and i think this is it for this session thank you Thank <music> you.